What's up guys? So decided to do a veterans pack opening and the reason I chose to do this is because I got so many gold and quicks uh gold and silver players from you know all those solos I was grinding out and I said, you know what the hell, let me do a veterans pack, let me see if I get lucky, you know, let me see if I get something that's worth anything decent, you know. And you see right here I actually ended up pulling Josh McCown and not something I was really looking for. You know, I knew there was a good chance I wasn't gonna pull anything good, you know. Stats look decent, of course, you know, decent pocket quarterback, but I didn't really have any interest in this guy. I definitely had no interest, honestly, in reviewing him, so I decided to quick sell him. And I saw he was going for about 50k, so I put him up there, and no, actually 55k at the time of the video, because this happened like maybe an hour ago. Put him on the auction, he sold within like in 15 minutes, you know, got... Uh, 49,000, so basically 50k, so not too bad. All the, the, uh, the reason also I decided to do this set because I was mulling over whether or not should I put these guys on auction, should I sell them, I mean, um, not sell them, but quick sell them for the training points, and also because I had a few non-auctionable tradable elites, you know, from the, uh, solo campaign, uh, the campaign, the gauntlet, all those packs that were just sitting there, you know, I, I couldn't sell them or anything like that, so I decided I definitely did not want to quick sell them, I wanted to at least try to do at least one um, pack opening to see if I, you know, just to tr try my luck and obviously it did not go that well. But I also want to talk to you guys about quick selling your players for training points. Let me know guys, what are you thinking? Because at the time, before I did this set, I, you know, clicked on all of them just curiously how much I would have gotten for all of it. I think it was like a 1,100 total if I would have just quick sold all of the elite players in the gold and the silver combined, I still have some left over, of course. But if I would have just quick sold them all at once, I would have got like a thousand one hundred, something like that. And that was tempting. Oh my goodness, man, that was tempting because I got Sean Taylor. I still got the Hall of Fame Tour Owens, and that's another thing. You know, this promo that dropped today, interesting little promo there for the Hall of Fame players. But um, yeah, like I was saying, just so damn tempting to quick sell that, get a thousand one hundred, and just use them to power up Sean Taylor, To. You know, it, it really was, but like I said, I wanted to get some coins mainly because I see how big my coin stack is now, and I just want to think, and I just want to hit that million coin um, milestone so soon because the game pretty much did just, you know, it's still recently new. So to have a million coins pretty much at launch within the first week or so would be huge. And it's tempting, believe me, oh my god, it's so tempting to buy some players, because, you know, on the auction. You know, my offensive line is not that great, my defensive ends are not that great. They're okay, but still, you know, there's so many guys I, I could buy to upgrade as tempting as it is, but I don't know. Because I, I'm worried that if I were to, you know, quick sell, get the training points and upgrade the power up players, maybe an a even better card would come out, you know, that I could afford and then I would just pretty much wasted my time. I know you can, like, go back and get some of your points back if you downgrade, but it's not like you're getting a full refund, so I don't know, guys. Anyways. This was my pack luck. It wasn't that great with the uh, veterans packs. Let me know, guys, in the comments. What are you doing? Are you getting coins? Are you just saving up as many training points as you're getting? Let me go. Let me know in the comments. Are you more for coins or training points? I'll see you, boys, next time, man. Peace.